today's video, I'm going to solve a problem from functions of complex variables. So here, u minus v is given as e power x times of cos y minus sin y. And now we have to find the analytic function f of z. See here, what is given from the question? u minus v is given as e power x into this is cos y minus sin y. Now, for my convenience, I'm making a derivative with respect to x. So that is dou u by dou x minus dou v by dou x is equal to. So with respect to x, it will be e, for e par x, this will be e par x and this is cos y minus this is sin y. And if I make a derivative with respect to y, see here for u, this is dou u by dou y and for v, this is dou v by dou y. So e par x treats as a constant and for cos y, this is minus sin y and again for sin y this will be cos y. So after making a derivative with respect to x and y, so we have to find the analytic function. For finding an analytic function, I am using Milne-Thompson method. So for finding an analytic function, so which method I am using? This is Milne-Thompson method. According to the Milne-Thompson method, so we have always... According to the Milne Thompson method, see here every time we have f of z is equal to. So f of z is equal to this is u plus i into v. So if I multiply with i, this is i into f of z will be. So this is i into u, i square, this is minus v. Got it? And if I make an addition, so if I add up these two, so this will be 1 plus i times of f of z is equal to, the real part here is u minus v plus the imaginary part is, this is u plus v. Got it? So we have this one. So 1 plus i into f of z value is equal to, so this is u minus v plus i times of this is u plus v. So for my convenience, I am writing this as 1 plus i times of f of z is equal to, this is capital U plus i times of capital V. So if I make a derivative with respect to x, see what happens here. So this will be 1 plus i into f dash of x is equal to. So this will be capital do u by do x plus i times of this is capital do v by do x. And see I am now using CR equations. According to the CR equations, according to the CR equations, we have do u by do x is equal to, this is do v by do y. And next, this is do u, u x is equal to v y and u y. And uh, u y is equal to, this is minus vx. So, in place of vx, I am writing dou u by dou y. So, I am transforming as, so this is 1 plus i, 1 plus i times of, this is f dash of z is equal to dou into capital U into dx. In place of dou v by dou x, I am writing minus dou u by, this is to y. So, what is capital U? So, here capital U is nothing but small u minus v. So, here if you observe, what is capital U? Capital U is nothing but small u, u minus v. And therefore, in place of uh, capital U, I am transforming in terms of small letters. That is u minus v. So, this will be, see here, this will be 1 plus i into f dash of z is equal to. In place of capital U, I am writing. That is dou u by dou x minus, this is dou v by dou x. And see here, minus, and see there is minus i, I here left over. So, there is i here. So, this is minus i times of. So, what is capital U? Capital U is nothing but small u minus small v. That is a small u with respect to y minus small v with respect to y. So, we have both the values ready here. So, we have small u minus small x and small u minus a small y that is f dash of z so this value is ready as e power x times of this is cos y minus sin y minus i times of this value is ready as see here this is e power x times of minus sin y and this is minus cos y cos y and now according to millie thompson method so i have to replace so replace x by z 
and this is y by 0. So if I replace, so what happens here? So this will be after replacing, so this will be 1 plus i into f dash of z is equal to in place of x if I write z and in place of uh, y as 0. So this is sin 0 minus i times of this is e power z times of sin 0 is 0 and this is minus cos 0. So minus cos 0 will be 1. So this will be 1 plus i times of f dash of z. So this is cos 0 is 1. So this is e power z minus i e power z and this value is minus 1. So this value is 1 plus i f dash of z is equal to this is e power z minus into minus plus i times of e power z. So 1 plus i into f dash of z is equal to if I take e power z common this will be 1 plus i. Now if I cancel 1 plus i on both sides then f dash of z is equal to this is e power z. Now if I integrate both sides with respect to z. So if I integrate both sides with respect to z then this will be f of z. So f of z is equal to this is e power z e power z plus c and which is which is our required analytic function. So this is our analytic function. So this is how we have to solve and this is so simple if you follow these steps and you can solve any problem of this type if you follow these steps. See here so this is uh, e power z plus c. Now let me explain you what is given small u minus v is equal to e power x into cos phi minus sin y. I made a derivative with respect to x and I made a derivative with respect to y. Now I am going to find out the analytic function. Using Milne's thomson method we have f of z is equal to u plus iv. So I multiplied with i throughout the equation and I added up these two equations. So I got 1 plus i of into f of z is equal to the real part here is u minus v plus i times of this is u plus v. So I can write this as capital U and uh, u plus small v as capital V. And now see here if I make a derivative with respect to x and using CR equation I transform dou v by dou x as minus dou u by dou y. So after transforming dou v by dou x as uh, dou u by dou y and we have capital U is equal to u minus v. So I made a derivative with respect to x. See here, I have both the values ready here. So, if after substituting both the values with respect to x and with respect to y here, and I replaced x by z and y by 0. And this is what I got. I got 1 plus i common on both sides. And after cancellation, I integrated both sides with respect to z. And so, I got f of z as e power x plus c. And this is uh, analytic function. This is how we have to solve. This is a simple process. You can follow uh, these steps for any kind of problem. And if you really like, you know what to do, please practice and share it with your friends. And have a look at my next video too. And it will be very, very useful for your preparation. Thank you so much.